All right, guys, what is going on? Welcome in. So look, I'm just gonna get right to the point here because I feel like this needs to be said. Um, one of my favorite players in the National Football League has just been released by the Arizona Cardinals, okay? Now, you could be asking yourself who, like, you know, who's one of the, you know, who is this player? It's Hakeem Butler, right? Now, Hakeem Butler, it might not ring a bell because he's never played a game in the National Football League. He was a fourth round pick last year out of Iowa State. But when you go back and you watch his tape at Iowa State, you'll notice a similar trend. And that trend is absolute domination inside the Big 12, okay? This dude standing at six foot five, 24 years old, was an absolute workhorse for the Cyclones. And, you know, you look at Matt Campbell's offense, they threw the ball a ton. So, you know, the numbers might be inflated, but it, actually, you know what? I'm gonna leave, um, I'll leave his highlight video like down, down in the description somewhere so you guys can check him out if you guys don't know him. Anyway, he was a fourth round pick in last year's draft. So not this past one, but 2019, ended up getting hurt. Uh, and now he's released, right? I mean, obviously, you know, the Cardinals still have Fitzgerald. They have uh, Christian Kirk, DeAndre Hopkins. They, uh, Andy Isabella, they have a lot of wide receivers over there in Arizona. Hakeem Butler was kind of the odd man out, right? Never playing a game. So I'm looking at this situation. The New York Jets are so thin at wide receiver. Denzel Mims hurt. Prashad Perryman kind of banged up. You know, Vincent Smith hurt. There's a lot of guys hurt in this Jets wide receiving room. I believe the New York Jets need to take a flyer on Akeem Butler immediately. This dude has so much upside, it's insane. And I was actually stunned that he went in the fourth round a couple years ago. I thought he would have been drafted way higher. Not in the first round, but you know, mid to late second round, early third round. That was kind of my you know estimation uh, or guesstimation for Butler. But at the end of the day, he's released and the Jets, the wide receiving the, the wide receiver needy Jets need to take a flyer on this dude. Okay, so let me know your thoughts down below. Like I said, check the description box. I'll uh, link his highlight video. I'll try to find a cool one um, down below. If you guys don't know him, you can search him, you know, on YouTube, on Google, whatever. Uh, anyway, just want to get this video out there. I believe the Jets need to take a hard look at this guy. I think he has so much potential and uh, he could fill that void for the Jets, right? He could be a major, major asset. So I'll leave it there. Let me know your thoughts. And as always, thanks so much for watching and go Jets.